If you guys want to get cheap shoes and NBA jerseys, click the link in my description. You can get jerseys for under $20 and shoes for $50 to $100. What is up, everybody? It is Eternal Mystery, the creator of Builds here, aka the middle child of the 2K community. And today, I'm going to be bringing you guys this free closed glitch on NBA 2K23. I'm on current gen when we're recording this, guys. Uh, if you guys want a next gen version, I could always hop on there for a different video. So comment down below in the comment section right now this is me calling you out if you do want to see a next gen version of the free clothes glitch or anything similar to it comment right now and say next gen just say next gen you don't have to say anything else just next gen or ng and i'll understand what you mean because next gen ng you know what i mean and uh, i'll know what you mean i read the comments by the way i just don't always respond to them uh especially is because like I get so many now on this channel and I have so many different channels. I'm rarely logged into this channel to respond to comments. Um, but yeah, I have, I have five YouTube channels if you guys didn't know. And I, I run all of them by myself, 100%. Except one of my channels I've been paying for thumbnails on, finally. So I literally make everything else myself except for paying for thumbnails for one channel. <laughs> so um, yeah, it's definitely a busy, busy schedule. So that's why you guys don't really see me responding to comments. I read all of them. I just don't want to take the time to respond to every single one, to be honest with you. I only respond to like some here and there. I might just start responding to all of them again, just because I feel like I feel kind of bad when I don't respond to all of them. But at the same time, it's like, you know, just people entering the giveaway and I'm like, OK, yeah, here we go. And just like mentally note that and write it down and add them to the giveaway list. So, yeah, basically, uh, speaking of giveaway, I am. Oh, I said that terribly. Speaking of giveaway, I am currently hosting a 40,000 subscriber giveaway. So when I do hit 40,000 subscribers, which we're getting close, I'll pick two winners to win the giveaway. The way you enter the giveaway is step one, subscribe to the channel. Step two, like this video that you are currently watching. Step three, turn on post notifications for the channel. Step number four is comment your favorite 2K game. And then step number five is do another comment saying done. All right, guys, so I want you guys to do all that. If you want to enter the giveaway, you might as well enter it. It's free. So two winners will win that giveaway. And then once I hit 40,000 subscribers, I'll do another giveaway for 50,000. I'll start one immediately. So when I hit 50,000, I'll pick, I don't know if I'm going to do two winners or more, but maybe I'll do three winners for 50K because 50K is a huge milestone. So maybe I'll do four or something, or maybe I'll just do like $25 for four different people instead of like $50 for two people or like $100 for one or $100 for two. You know what I mean? So anyway, we're going to go ahead and jump into this glitch here. I do want to explain though that, like I said, this is on current gen. And um, yeah, basically current gen is different than next gen for some glitches. This is going to be different. So what we're going to do, we are going to load up into my career first off, obviously, right? So I'm going to load into this build right here. My only build on current gen, I literally made it just for these videos uh, because I don't have current gen player. I didn't really play current gen this year or last year. I played a little bit of current gen last year, just a little bit of it, but uh, I didn't play this year. I haven't really even played 2K that much this year. I played mostly my team in like my league or eras whatever you want to call it my nba eras so yeah that's mostly what i've been doing on this game and uh season four is right around the corner as you guys can see uh i think i mentioned that already i'm not sure it, unless that was the other video recorded today but six days left of season three um so honestly we're about to be seeing some season four news probably in like two days so i personally don't care because i don't really play this game i'm, I'm just here to bring you guys the content you know what i mean so uh basically we're in the boat, the goat boat over here. Sounds so sus, but yep, it's called the goat boat. And um, yeah, basically what you want to go ahead and this is my first time seeing the scenery, I think, as well, because I haven't been playing 2K and I haven't been recording videos for a couple of months because I haven't uploaded that much in a couple of months or I've been doing glitches I don't have to load into my career for. Um, but what you want to go ahead and do is go to the elevator, which, yep, it's back here. For a minute, I thought I was and I was questioning my instincts of where I was going. And before I even start this glitch, I want to show you guys that I have like no clothes on this account. Um, I don't think I have pre-order clothes yet. Literally no clothes, nothing. So you're going to see literally everything is blank, guys. So we're going to go ahead and uh, run over here. Elevator. What you want to do is go to the silver deck. I'm assuming it's so. Yep, it's silver deck. And then promenade. There you go. Promegranate. I called it promegranate in a video on, on 2K22 current gen. And y'all were going crazy at me. <laughs> that was funny, bro. But yeah, man, prom promenade, whatever, promegranate um so basically here we are we're chilling right we're chilling up here and you can do this with any of the shops right guys so let's just like look through all the shop i feel like i spawn in a different spot than i would have normally i don't know why um oh no i don't want to go to the 1v1 court um so basically you got like the converse shops you got all the different shoe shops all that kind of stuff 
you know you got i don't think you can do it for like wheels or like the tattoos or anything like that i think you kind of have to stick to like actual clothing places um so if we like cross the bridge real quick and we just do this let's do my daily prize if i even can i forgot if you can on current yeah you can so let's, let's do that oh my god 20 boosts oh, i got a trophy for that wow uh 20 boosts nice um never gonna use those <laughs> and that's better than my rewards on next gen when i would play it uh anyway so we walk around over here you guys are gonna see there's all kinds of shops under armor we got puma the nba store so most likely you guys are gonna want to do it on the nba store and the uh swags which I, I think swag is literally across the street oh no it's right here there we go swags so you guys can either want to do it on swags or probably the nba store so i could go i usually go to swags for this video i could go to the nba store i'm actually curious i haven't been in the nba store in a minute let me just check this real quick to see what they got going on in here because you might got you guys might be more interested in this oh they got mitchell and ness now oh they got terrible jerseys for mitchell and ness though they got these like weird like gray jerseys never mind um and then i think it's just it's like the normal yep normal stuff right there jerseys let's see they have like alternates no they don't so you guys probably don't even care about the nba store do you most likely right state farm oh my goodness that's crazy um yeah, you guys most likely don't even care that much about i mean maybe this stuff right here the mitchell and nest area I always say nest instead of nest but anyway let's go to swags you guys definitely care more about swags so what you want to do is go to swags just walk right past the door go to swags right in here and then what you want to do, you want to have you want to have your cart be worth more VC than what you have. So I'm honestly going to just go ahead and just click on. Uh, let's see what's probably exp everything's probably expensive. Oh, I got to be level 35 for that. Uh, we'll go ahead and get this Canada. This is so ugly, bro. Like we're paying this much for this ugly like vest and 2K. That's crazy. Anyway, um, I'm not supposed to be clicking on that. So let me undo that. You want to hit X and square at the same time to try it on and add to your cart. And then do this for all the items you want. So I'm just going to do this for the goose pants. There we go. Boom. X and square or um, A and X if you're an Xbox. And then hit triangle. You can do this as slow as you want. And then hit X twice and then back and hit circle. Now it's going to say, are you sure you want to leave swag? Say no. And then hit circle and say yes. And now you're either supposed to have them on you or you're, they're supposed to be in your clothes inventory. And as we are going to go look right now, neither of that has happened. They're not in the inventory. They're not on me. This is me exposing a fake clothes glitch, free clothes glitch. There's a ton of them out there for some reason. I think there's like three or four that I could have made a video on, but I decided to do this one it's because this is probably the dumbest one, honestly, because like there's nothing that I feel like people would convince people that this is real. You know what I mean? Um, but people fell for it in the comment section. But if you guys know what YouTuber this is, comment down below. Uh, also, I just want to say if you guys are going to complain about me I'm not titling this exposed, answer this question right now. Would you have clicked on this video if it said exposing a free clothes glitch? I'm going to leave it right there. I'm going to drop the mic. That's going to be it for this video, guys. Make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe, turn notifications, all that kind of stuff, and I'm out.